Hi, good evening everyone. Welcome to this event by the European Society. My name is Anthony Salomone. I'm the president of the Society. We have our great pleasure to welcome Pablo Delica to the Society and back to the LSC to speak once again. Um, let's have a look first at uh, the European Union, uh, what it stands for today. I must say I've been dealing with the European Union affairs uh, basically since uh, December 1989 when uh, someone in, uh, at that time, Czechoslovakia, <coughs> I, I, I have a reason to believe that it was Václav Havel who said uh, we would like to join the European communities. Uh, it is a re return to Europe of Czechoslovakia at that time. Uh, that was a time when I was uh, the Minister of Foreign Affairs and I uh, had been given the opportunity to deal with the European uh, uh, with EC Affairs for one reason. At that time, no one really uh, saw any perspective in the agenda. So they found the most junior guy that was available and he was given the, the dossier of, uh, of EC because uh, there's, um, there would be nothing coming out of it anyway. So that was the logic. But uh, uh, since, uh, since 89, 90, I've been dealing with it, and I must say that the EU, or EC at that time, have changed dramatically. It is, uh, <laughs> it is still a unique uh, society, an integration society. It is, uh, uh, I think, quite an achievement. I think uh, we take uh, a lot of things uh, for granted today, in including uh, the fact that uh, we have experienced uh, decades of uh, peace, uh, security, and, uh, and quite uh, rapid uh, economic uh, development. Uh, but uh, we don't have to look uh, too far uh, uh, from the EU borders to see that this is not something that we should be taking for granted.